When Theseus he sailed back from Crete, old Plutarch made the quip. All the planks decay, replaced with new, but is it the same ship? Here in old Boston's navy yard, we still use Grandad's axe to refit Constitution. She's the same, and that's the facts. So here's to her copper bottom, that once more is hid from view. And to all the copper pennies it took to make old Ironsides new. She's got live oak from Florida to cut the water main. She's got new trail boards, hawse holes too, to run the anchor chain. A hundred planks, each steam to fit Josh Humphrey's grand design. Gone carriages and masts and sails, new quarter galleries fine. So here's to her copper bottom, that once more is hid from view. And to all the copper pennies it took to make old Ironsides new. Hull's victory was of cannon, Stuart's victory was of sails, but the victory of the Cockers took 300,000 nails, 12,000 sheets of copper, each backed with Irish felt, engraved with signatures galore below her new red belt. So here's to her copper bottom that once more is hid from view, and to all the copper pennies it took to make old Ironsides new. Two years caged up in dry dock was our eagle of the sea. At 9 p.m. she lifts her blocks. At midnight she sails free. And if you put your John Hancock on her sides of iron fame, every fish in Boston Harbor will be proud to know your name. So here's to her copper bottom that once more is hid from view. And to all the copper pennies it took to make old Ironsides new. Yes, here's to her copper bottom that once more is hid from view. And to all the copper pennies it took to make old Ironsides new. Huzzah!